This was the final judging of the Neural Engineering Tech Studio competition, where we had four teams that were presenting to a panel of industry judges. We had a range of students from different engineering backgrounds and actually from also neurobiology and applied math this year as well. The work that we do at the center is always really tied to patient populations and people who can potentially benefit from the devices that we create. Students did a really good job connecting with the users that will eventually adopt their devices and benefit from all the hard work that they've done. It's awesome to get to know a user of our potential problem because then we can come up with a more realistic user profile. The uh, focus for all of us really was to build something that we hope was the first step towards something that Eric, our friend uh, who wants to use this device, can actually take away and maybe at some point in the future be able to use by himself. The fact that we could get EMG signals from him made the problem and the solution very, very tangible. The satisfaction of like seeing him actually can be able to use it and he can actually vision himself using it in the future. It's like the best thing in the world. So it kind of gives me the chills a little bit. Students are so good at thinking outside of the box and good at doing that really quickly. It's always surprising to me what they can get accomplished in a very short period of time. Every single team out there was really, really strong, really, really interesting ideas, really interesting problem spaces. So this just inspires me to learn more about how I can use neural engineering to solve a lot of these problems. I really enjoy what's, what we have achieved. At the end of it, I think it provides a clearer picture of what it is to be working in a group of people with different abilities towards a common cause. It's the end of an exciting journey in this course, but we're excited to do a lot more. One of the things that we talk about a lot in the center is how we can teach students to be creative and innovative. And for me, I think it always shows that students are already creative and innovative. They just need an opportunity to show how creative they really are.